Hello and welcome. My name is DW and this is my little slice of the internet. I like to call it Dub's Beauty Diary. Today we are having an update. So this is my second update for Fab Four. So the Fab Four project pan was created by Liza Key over on Instagram. I will have them linked down below. Um, this is a fantastic ladies collab. Um, we went from August 5th to April 5th, um, roulette style, working on four prompts at a time. You can work on more than four if you want to get through all the prompts, monthly updates. So um, we're updating on or around the 5th. I decided I wanted to roll in four products or prompts every, every update. Um, even if I haven't, ha even if I don't have any rollouts. Um, so it says the Beatles made some amazing music that have stood the test of time. I uh, love the Beatles if you are new here. <laughs> um, this project is a fun ode to their songs and history. Start date is October 5th. The Beatles released their first single, Love Me Do. Love me do, I, I love you. On this date in 1962. Um, and ends April 5th with monthly updates, roulette style with Fab with four fab products at a time. Set your own goals, get creative. The themes and colors can apply to the product themselves, the shade names, the packaging, the brand. If you can't think of anything for a prompt, you can re-roll. So pretty open-ended and I love that about projects. I'm not like a huge prompt-based project fan, but I love the Beatles, so I had to do this one. Um, Amy and Melissa talked me into it, uh, it's fine. Anyway, uh, currently I have six products in my little lineup. We've got um, this Ilia Mascara sample for Can't Buy Me Love. It is, uh, I rolled this in and it's in the intro and it is on its last leg. Like there is only maybe a couple of applications left. So this will be staying in. Got to get you into my life. Um, for that, it was a repurchase, I believe. Oh, Can't Buy Me Love was something that was gifted to you or gift with purchase or you didn't buy and that was a birthday gift from Sephora. Um, got to Get You Into My Life is a repurchase and for that I chose the e.l.f. Um, Instant Lift Brow Pencil in taupe and we have her finished. So she is a Ghana. And that was also in the intro. So now my first update, I rolled in Baby You're a Rich Man and that was a high-end um, product. And so I rolled in my Pat McGrath Blitz Astro Quad in Nocturnal Nirvana. And um, if you remember, I thought this was giving me eye irritation. I thought I'd gone off. I uh, just wanted to double check that. So use each shade a couple of times and I did that. And safe to say, this is going to stay in my collection. It did not give me any irritation. So that is amazing. So this will, this prompt is rolling out. Um, then we rolled in eight days a week. So something you had to use eight days in a row. I did not, full disclaimer, I did not use this eight days in a row, but I did use it eight different times. I will post photos over here of all of my looks that I did with this silly little alien or yeah, alien cosmetics, now unearthly red lipstick in Minerva. I... I'm okay with um, red lipstick now. I'm okay with it. You knew that was gonna happen, didn't you? But um, yeah, this was rolled in last update and completed. Then we rolled in and I love her and I had rolled in this Soul ColourPop um, highlight. I wanted to use this 10 times or just use it consistently and I completely forgot about this. So that is going to be staying in. I'll put it in my bin right now so I don't forget about it. And I rolled that in last update. Um, and then Penny Lane, which was a affordable product. And for that, I rolled in my e.l.f. Halo Glow. And there is 
tiny bit left in here. So we will be keeping this in. I wanted to finish it. We will be keeping this in for just a like, maybe one more update, maybe not even. Like there's, we're, we're cutting it close. Like today when I was putting it on, I had to like really scrape to get some on the wand. So this will be staying in. So we're keeping the Ilia Mascara for Camp I Me Love just to finish, the e.l.f. Halo Glow in, for Penny Lane to finish, and the um, ColourPop Soul and I Love Her to use consistently, 10 times. Um, but we are still going to do four new Rollins. So let me get my little, my little wheel. Um, where is it? Spin the wheel. Fab Four Project Pan. All right, let's do this. Paperback writer. Paperback writer. I love that song. A book themed or reminds you of a specific book. Okay. Next. Rom, well, come on. Solo career. Um, an item meant to be used in combination with others, but you can also use it alone. Only one shade in a palette, only one side of a duo, one item from a kit, etc. So, like all of the Beatles uh, essentially went their own ways and they all had a pretty successful, in my opinion, solo career. Um, I have seen Paul McCartney, uh, George Harrison passed before I was um, going to show, so that was unfortunate, but he is my favorite Beatle. Um, and I'm hoping to see Ringo eventually here before he dies too. Um, third prompt. White album, I already did that one. Everybody's got, I already did that one. Mop top, a hair product, okay. And last but not least, let it be. So fun fact, every time I sing let it be, specifically it has to be in conjunction with the Beatles, not a cover, I will start crying. It's inevitable. I will just literally start crying. Anyway, let it be. Long lasting product that you can apply once and let it be all. So I'm going to go find my four products and I will be right back. All right, I think I have my products. So the first thing we rolled in was Paperback Writer, um, which was a book theme or reminds you of a specific book. And I could not, I couldn't, I couldn't do this. So I went with a stretch and I chose the Book of Magic. Um, find your beauty ritual in her spell book and cast magical looks to be witch. I, I know it's a stretch. It's fine. Um, I just want to do a no pan left behind on this. Um, solo career, which was an item meant to be used in combination with others, but use it alone. One shade in the palette. Um... I definitely took this the wrong way, but I'm going to keep it in anyway. So melt uh, raw honey. Um, I, I thought it meant that you use them in conjunction, but anyway, I'm going to use this um, five times, this blush. Mop top. 
um, a hair product. So I've had this product forever and it's almost gone. Um, I just want to finish it. It's the Redken Acidic Perfecting Concentrate Leave-In Treatment. Um, intense conditioning, heat protecting, styling aid, hydrating intense protection. It's good for processed hair, but see, that's how long I've had this. Like, I don't have any color in my hair anymore, and I'm still trying to finish this. So I want to actually use this and finish it just to clear up some space. Um, let it be long lasting product that you can apply once and let it be all day. Pixie Glow Mist, um, just setting spray in general. I only set when I do my makeup and then it's my makeup lasts all day. Doesn't matter what um, spray I use, it's nice. Um, I just want to finish this. Shouldn't be hard. Um, so then the other items we still have in the project are the e.l.f. Halo Glow to finish. Almost done with that. The Soul um, Shimmering Body Power and Catwalk. I just want to use this 10 times. Um, I'm going to write that down so I don't forget. <laughs> And then the Ilia mascara to finish, and this is almost gone. So, yeah, with that being said, so we have six items again, um, which is kind of, it's a, it's a good number. But with that being said, we will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.